And back we go. Beeging down things. Are people suffering attrition? No, no. That. Let's just combine again. Safety in numbers. And we're also earning money still. Didn't raise all our troops, so that's good. Okay, once we've done the siege, we have to go and kill this host here. Ah. A daughter. Who may not inherit. She will go struggle. She will also go ahead and marry someone good. Strong? Anyone? No, only old people. Quick. Well, eight is not bad. Um, attractive, maybe? No. Genius? Let's take the courtier in Breda, the Dutch boy. Who's a genius for her. He's much older than her. So when she comes of age... That's okay. Nothing but the best for her. I'm again leading the wrong flank. Why is there this constant redistribution of flank material? Give me the right flank to lead. So we win this siege, we beat them back, we beat them back. That's the plan. So we go here. Fine, we attack straight. Give them some semblance of a chance. We lost the command, I believe. Yes. Luckily, not the important commander, meaning us. How did we get in here without... I should know this by now. Ah, who cares? We're just going to attack straight ahead. It'll be fine. Then we take more troops from home. Oh, we already raised those. Let's do this. And back we go here. Stop putting me on the wrong flank. Stop it. Your king demands the right flank to lead. There's only one flank for your king to lead and it's the one that I want. Not the other one that I don't want. How's our cash flow? Still alright. A lot to be sieged here. By the way, why was I not informed that my wife was pregnant? That's a bit odd. Find some people. Maybe good at war stuff. Can we find anyone who can siege? Find an architect, maybe? Nope. This is the best the world has to offer currently. Well, the world that would like to join. can actually put it to any. We don't really need to limit ourselves to this. There's someone better. Few people actually. I don't know why I've hurt myself so the past 
There's even a siege man. Okay, I think we save this one as a new slot one. Because what do we care? Our reputation, our, our relationship is not going to be as good. With people who are not of our culture group and not our religion and all that, but... Uh -huh. They're just here to lead our troops and die for us. All they're here for. Okay, let's get the siege master in there first. He gets the center. And then replace a bunch of people down there. This mayor can be replaced. Man can be replaced. Did I see this correctly that we have a woman waiting on the sidelines? Oh yes. Camilla von Badenberg. She's pregnant. She will be a pregnant commandress. Right. He gets this flank. And before we continue the siege, we're going to quickly tell that host where to it. Maybe his troops are going to make a reappearance as well. Yeah, there they are. Smelling the opportunity to retake what we have sieged from them. But they are not going to enjoy their time there. Okay, our really well-led flank is already breaking. Quicker than all the other flanks we got. That's fantastic. Only flank that broke was the one with a really, really good guy. Hmm. What to think of that? Let's put this man in and see if he works out a little bit better. And if this guy the low level leadership. Oh no, not another epidemic. Probably the Black Death. Should we become Catholic? That way we can join Holy Wars and stuff. We're, we're a heresy anyway. Yeah, let's become Catholic. That's not going to change all that much. Must... Become crowned once we're out of war. Didn't change anything here, did it? Nope. See, this flank is doing much better already. Weird. Luckily, so far, no one has come up on the battlefield to try and take us out. We'll speed this along a tiny little bit. Because it's just siege work now anyway. And maybe fighting him off. Okay, who do we put in the center? Yeah, we're going to attack him again. Maybe we get the percent we need. It's highly doubtful. Ah, oh, there was a good chunk of them fleeing there. Now we just go siege, hopefully. Finishing this soon. There's another host, or it's the same host. We are suffering from a host infection. So let's pay something expensive. And something a little less expensive. Let's spend some of that money that we've accumulated.
Two holes. Lovely. Right, okay. So we want to be crowned now. And only the Pope is fit to crown us. He will have terrible demands to make of us to get the coronation done. Oh, he just wants money this time. Can have it. And we will have a dignified ceremony. And our child will be kind. Okay. Good. So we're meeting new rulers and we can improve our diplomacy a little bit here. Stand on our troops. Ah, let's try and be friends with our vassal here. Which we are. It's all part of the ceremony to receive the crown and I am finally truly king crowned by the Pope himself. Yeah, let's have some war games. And nice to do a strong frontal, frontal assault toward our center flank. We will slowly withdraw the forces in the center. And then we will hold in and surround the enemy. And thus we have won the game of strategy. Lovely. Who are you, courtier? I don't care. Eluch prospers. My wife is pregnant again. I was just about to ask how her status is. Let's look how we are doing army wise, still recouping. But not far from the maximum we can have. So these are now our tributary, giving us lots and lots of money, I hope. Check how much money they actually give us. Yeah, not bad. About as much as all our cities pay us. And he's quite strong now as well. Another daughter for us. Ooh, a strong one. That's lovely. She will struggle as well. And she also will only accept a matrilineal marriage. Quick. A few quick ones. Genius's ones? No. Attractive. Eh. Quick is better. So... We'll take this courtier in Memphis. I mean, we could do the whole alliance thing, but since we don't have any sort of air right now... Ah, the plague approaches. Let's check our hospital real quick. Let's build this. It's cheaper and quicker. And gives the same, more or less the same bonus. Black death creeps toward us. We will, this time we will shut the gates. The second we get the option. Because this is going to be terrible. Also, we're just going to auto assign commanders because they're going to drop like flies as it is. Check we have a designated regent. Still like us. Better one, so it will be right person for the job. Right. 
Now we try and weather the storm. And we will throw out anyone who has the symptoms. Okay, we have five remaining food, which is not good. Already starting now. We'll keep throwing out people. And we can't manage our food because we are not very good at stewardship. I'll just keep removing people from the court. And we have three remaining food, I believe. Um, hmm. And we need to reign for 10 years and have all the court counts like us. Can I take both counties from him? Or just one? Let's try. Take both counties from him. So we did. Alright, okay. So now we have some new counties to hand out. Let's see who is deserving amongst our people. Commander of Armenia. It wasn't very good. Leading troops. He would do as a great marshal. It's not ambitious. And he has an heir. He's Polish, but Catholic. A good Catholic. So let's give him Tarbron and Edessa. Not the duchy. County. And... This man has also served us well so far. Is he ambitious? Yes, he is ambitious. He gets nothing. Plus, he has the great pox. He's going to die soon. Any good kids here? Let's get a diplomatic kit going. Greek Orthodox wrong. I'm also orthodox. Sevak. Oh, he's a learned man. He's a Jewish learned man. Probably just actually look at our... Let's... Let us go ahead and... Search our realm. Not for siege, but we're going to look for men who are not rulers, but who like us well. Man doesn't have a wife nor kids. Not ideal. Ah, uh, let's give him this. So he gets Tel Bashir. How is this both highlighted for the county of Eintub? Okay. Weird. And he gets the county of oh, he doesn't get the county of Tel Bashir let's get someone else to have the county of Tel Bashir 
Let's give it to the other guy here. There we go. Now we've taken care of all this. And we have inherited the bishopric because our uncle, I think, died. Okay. Um, our courtier will die. What does cannibal do again? Minus 10 general opinion. People don't like cannibal. And we kick people out, of course. Okay, people keep eating our stuff. And the Black Death only just begun to spread here. He's also ate outstayed his welcome. And we will not resort to eating rats. Because I feel eating rats is going to be problematic. So what's going on with this now? Why are we losing? All right. There's no heir of our dynasty left. We might be walking towards game over right now. Unless we can get... When did we become king? 14 or something? We might be able to change the succession law the absolute prognatic before we die but that's a big if another big if all right let's get let's get uh rid of the bishopric and transfer the vassalage of the bishopric of arati to him and this we also don't want and we transfer the vassalage of this i'm looking for the city this here transfer vassalage of this to him. I don't want it. What? We have inherited another baron. Barony. Barony. Great one. Out of thin air. So we will just sit here and watch this. And click this the second it becomes available. Oh no. We are starving now. Okay, we will become cannibals. It's time. Um, we are starving. I think it's time to open the gates. We need food again. Oh god. God help us indeed. And we've inherited another county. Ah, there we go. Succession laws changed. We can go for absolute cognatic in combination with ultimogenitor. So our girls and our line is secure again because there is a lot of women in our line 
but we are the last men of the house Hetumi. Can you believe that? Our lovely strong daughter who has probably contracted the sickness and is starving. Oh god. God help us. God help us indeed. 